Hey muffins, it's Tuesday. I'm vlogging on Tuesdays and Thursdays this week. Shree's doing Wednesdays and Fridays because she has some stuff going on. So we switched the vlog days, which should be pretty much the same because I don't do anything different on Tuesdays and Thursdays, except go work out. And Matt, my favorite instructor, comes back tonight. I'm so excited. I didn't work out at all last week because really tight schedule and I didn't feel like making time for classes I didn't really want to go to. You know what I mean? I wasn't overly motivated. It's not the best excuse, but that's just what happened. So, mm. not going to be that way this week. No, no. I have to go to the gym every day because we're going to the Great Wolf Lodge this weekend. The indoor water park, if you guys haven't heard of it. Um, but I don't want to be feeling bloated and stuff, so I have extra motivation this week to be really good. That'll be good. Um, also, my husband just started Weight Watchers. Super proud of him. And, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll have him weigh in with you guys a little bit one of these days, either today or Thursday, and tell you how he's feeling. Um, but, yeah, he started, which has been fun. I prepped a bunch of oh, breakfasts for us yesterday. I made a bunch of mini quiches um, so he could take them to work and just pop them in the toaster oven. And um, made some for myself too because meal prep, hey, it works. You know, meal prep is honestly the best way to be successful during your day. Um, so, yeah, so that's really cool. I love that... We're now adapting a healthy lifestyle together. He went for a run yesterday. He hasn't exercised in like over a year. So I'm super proud of him. Um, and I love that our kids get to see that, you know, and in their mind that'll look like what we, like things that people do, you know, instead of being like, people don't exercise. My family doesn't exercise. I don't know. I just like setting good examples for them. Anyway. We don't have our Christmas tree up yet because our cats, I'm terrified, but I need to just make the leap and do it. The um, Elf on the Shelf visited us this year. It's our first year that they came to us and it's been really fun. Every morning the girls have been finding her in some pretty fun places, so that's been really cool. I'll have to show you guys where she showed up this morning. Um, but she was in a marshmallow bathtub the other day. Um, she was playing their pie face game yesterday. The other two days she was just on the shelf for them. She's been a busy girl. So that's been really fun. But uh, yeah, I've been kind of rambling here for about three minutes. I am drinking my coffee. The huge. But look at it. It's in a Christmas cup. I don't know what's my deal this year. I'm super into Christmas. I've never been this into it. But I want to watch like Christmas shows and I want to make Christmas cookies and drink out of Christmas mugs. I don't know what's wrong with me, what's happening. I'm normally such a Scrooge. But uh, yeah, so see you guys at breakfast. Oh, I'm a one-handed, let's see if I can. Okay guys, so here's breakfast. I have two of these mini crustless egg quiches that I made. Um, they're only two points a piece. So it's egg, um, there's deli sliced ham, uh, fat free cheddar and green onions. And then I'm going to have it with some of my favorite Taco Bell hot sauce. Hi guys. <clears throat> so it's like 11 o'clock and I'm hungry. Um, so I'm going to eat some crepes. I also ate two Ritz crackers. Um, I was giving them to my son and I had one earlier and then... He was eating them and then fed me one. So they're one point a piece. Two points for two crackers, totally not worth it. But I had them. So they're tracked. <laughs> I tracked two Ritz crackers. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna eat these and then I think I'm gonna make some lunch. I haven't quite decided what I wanna have yet. Um, I've already tracked my dinner and I have a lot of points left, like 20 points. So I could have a really big lunch, or I have a medium-sized lunch, have a snack. Possibilities are endless. But I'm for sure gonna have another cup of coffee after these grapes, too. 
I'm tired. I don't want to do anything. So grapes, coffee will be another point. So, mmm. I forgot to tell you guys my weigh-in. Because I know not everybody watches the muffin chat, but. So, my weigh-in was. When I first stepped on the scale, Friday, I was exactly the same. I was 154.4. Exactly the same as I was the week before. And then I um, stepped off, stepped back on, and I was down 0.1. I just left it the same in the app because I don't know what it is. It's just 0.1. But yeah. So, and I didn't even notice until this week that it dropped my weeklies to 26. So obnoxious. Um, so I get 26 weeklies now instead of 36. Horrible. But anyway, I'm going to eat my grapes and I will talk to you guys at lunch. Hey guys, so here's my lunch. I decided I wanted to have some pizza, so I'm having the Trader Joe's Lavash bread here. Um, I have a full thing, which is seven points. I have a half a cup of sauce, I have 14 armor, uh, turkey, pepperoni, and three ounces of the Trader Joe's light mozzarella cheese. So I can't remember the breakdown specifically, but my whole lunch was 16 points because I made my kids one too and I ate two pieces like this of theirs, which made it 16 points. So I'm having that and some Diet Dr. Pepper. This, if I count in my dinner, leaves me with four points to kind of snack on. So. I'm sure my son will eat a piece of this too. Okay, so here's dinner. It's eight points worth of the coconut curry chicken. It's made with a reduced fat um, coconut milk. Two points worth of the Trader Joe's brown rice, the kind that you just microwave, which is half a cup. And then a bunch of raw spinach. Husband's having it too for his 10 point dinner. How was your first day on Weight Watchers? Or your Good. second day? Good. Yeah. So, how many points do you have left after this? I have mm, 19, I have 11. Yeah, he's doing really good, so we're about to eat. Yum. Hi guys. So, it's workout time. Work. Yes, I am feeling it today. I'm so excited. I have my new workout shirt on. You can't read it because it's super dark, but it says, Dear Cardio, I hate you. <laughs> Which I don't, I don't hate cardio now. I don't hate Zumba. I hate other cardio, that's for sure. But um, I'm so happy to be back. I'm so happy to be back. I think all of the extra stress in my life, no way to decompress, all of that is really just eaten up at me. Um, also, when I put on my workout clothes, I never feel like svelte, you know what I mean, when I put them on, but I felt really bloated in them and uncomfortable. So I was like, mm. <laughs> well um which i know it's just like water or whatever but when i don't work out that water doesn't go away it just kind of hangs around um but yeah so just got to the gym i have a little bit of time but it's his first class back and he announced it on facebook so i know it's going to be packed um he just has that that effect on the class here like it's insane when he's gone the classes are really small when he's here they're like Boom! Like, so close. It's crazy. But, uh, yeah, so I stopped over at Walgreens. I had to pick up some more vitamins because um, I was out, and I can tell when I'm out of vitamins. Like, I just don't feel as good. That's when I'm taking them. So, remedy the vitamin situation. I'm going to the gym. I am, like, pretty much a health guru now. So, you know. Um, today, food-wise, went super good. I basically have no weekly, so there's no wiggle room for me whatsoever. So I have four points left for the day. What I plan to do when I get home is just have some of the sugar-free hot apple cider. So good. Jessica from Weight Watchers Guide to Health. I don't know. Um, anyway, she <laughs> posted it, and it was, I found it at my store. So good. Um, it's like totally warm and sweet and just like makes me feel whenever I have like tea or cider at night I'm always like mm, pampering myself you know so that's how I felt 
every night that I've had it. So I'll have that feeling again tonight. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I don't plan to eat anything else though because it's like almost eight o'clock and I'm good. So I won't get home till like 9.30. But I will check in with you guys afterwards so you can see the sweat because it gets so real. And he's all talking about he got a new routine. Oh, I bet he's gonna come in here and just work. So, anyway, ah, I'm so glad to be back on Zumba. Like I really am, I'm such a, I'm a nerd. So, I'll see you guys briefly afterwards for a little, little check-in, just a little bit. Who oh, girl, <laughs> I am dead. I really should have taken a picture so you guys could see my shirt. It is so soaked. Oh my gosh, I got my booty handed to me. He was back and on another level. Oh my gosh, such a good workout. And then he was like practicing a new routine at the end, so I got a little bit of an extra workout. <sighs> yes! So it was packed. I like it when the class is packed a little bit because it feels super fun. You know, there's like a lot of energy and um, yeah, it's just, it's, it's good. So, Oh, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. I missed the girls that I talked to. I missed sweating my butt off and feeling super good afterwards. I missed it all. Missed it all. So happy to be back at the gym. Gym flow? Anyway, so now it's 930 and I am wound up. I am so like pumped right now. I'm gonna have to go home and try and like calm myself down with some hot cider. That's what I'm gonna do. So I hope that you guys had an amazing day and uh, stay tuned tomorrow for Cherie's vlog. She's me vlogging on a Wednesday and that's it. I'll see you guys on Thursday. Have a good beginning of your week.